Hi, welcome to automation testing dot in. In this video, we are going to see prioritizing the test in test ng. And what is prioritizing in test ng means? Uh, in this, we'll see the uh, order of execution test in test suit. We'll write test methods our own way using at the rate test annotation. After writing the test cases, we will execute the test cases they manually means uh, normally or from the test engine.xml file. After execution of the test, if we observe the order of execution, then we can find that all the test cases will be executed in alphabetical order. And all the tests will have the equal priority as we did not set any priority to the tests. Means uh, you have a test class, in your test class you have written uh, so many methods. So many methods means let's uh, assume three to four methods. This three to four methods you have written in such a way that your own way, uh, whenever you find uh, some uh, 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 means uh, you will not follow any order. Then if you exude these test cases, then you can find that if you write uh, like uh, second test case first, first test case second and third test case fourth, something like that, even though if you exude the test cases, they will exude in an alphabetical order. Okay, and uh, all the test cases will have the same priority that uh, we have a attribute uh, called priority to your thread test annotation. We did not set that priority to any test method. So all the test cases will have the same kind of priority. So if you want to uh, set the priority, you have to use uh, one of the attributes called priority. And by default, all the test cases will have the priority equal to zero means if you did not set any priority to the test case uh, at the rate test annotation then all the tests will take the priority as zero okay and if you give the priority equal to all the test cases also then it will execute in the alphabetical order means uh, as we discussed uh, all the test cases will have the priority zero if you did not set the priority attribute so if you set priority equal to one 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 for all the test cases even though uh, all the test cases will have the same priority then also it will execute alphabetical order. But if you want to change according to our requirement, how we will get this uh, like you know, of requirement, we will, we will see in this video. And the examples we are going to discuss in this without priority and partially use priority attribute and with priority attributes. We will see these three examples to understand the priority. Now we'll jump into uh, Eclipse. Now I'll create a sample class and I'll name it as without priority. Okay, I'll take it without priority. Now we'll see how we'll see the without priority. I'll create three test methods in this at the rate test public void first test okay to better understanding we'll see like this is second test okay and I'll import at the rate test and I'll write sample console uh, message to print system dot out dot print ln and I'll say I'm um, in second the test okay I'll take the same way I'll take the same way two more methods second uh, third test and fourth test okay I am in third test I am in fourth test see this is what our test cases means I have taken three test uh, test cases one is second test third test and fourth test three test cases and you observe the pre um, alphabetical order F will comes first right A B C D E F then S T means first fourth test will come this comes first as per alphabetical order and the second this will come and third this will come okay according to this f t yes this alphabetical order but we have written in such a way that second test we have written first and then third test we have written second 
and fourth test we have written third means one two three but while executing this will execute first this will execute second and this will execute third means this is alphabetical order okay now we'll execute and see is executing in such a way that or not right click run as test ng test now we'll observe the output that how these test cases executed uh, once again I'll, there is an issue i'll execute once again you see that fourth test first where is the fourth test it executed first but it is in third position and then second test where is the second test this is in first position and third test and third test is in second position but here executed in different way that it is in alphabetical order f comes first s second second uh, third comes third means t comes third this way it will execute alphabetical order okay if you write how how you want but the test engine will execute in alphabetical order now we will see uh, partially use priority okay means what we will do we will give the priority to this one as we discussed at the rate test annotation have one of the attributes called priority see priority equal it will accept integer 1 2 3 4 5 something like that at the same way I'll give this priority to this one as 2 okay I'll give this priority to fourth test as 2 and first uh, second test as 1 now I have given a priority to this test and this test I did not given any priority to this test then what will happen means the default priority to this test is equal is zero why because if you did not mention any priority then we will take it as priority zero then it executes first why because zero takes the high priority zero takes the high priority and then one and then two means zero one two three and so on then how it should execute now third test will execute first and then it will it will see for the priority then this is the f uh, one means second it will execute second and then it will execute third this way it should execute now we'll execute and see the same way it is executing or not right click run as test ng test now if you observe the output see third test executed first okay third test executed first if it is go for alphabetical order f should come first okay but we have set the priority forcefully to all these tests so third test executed first as this is 0th priority then it will go for the first priority so the second test executed second and fourth test executed last as the priority is equal to 2 means last priority here it took 1 0 1 2 this order it executed this way you can set the priority to your test which ex which should execute first which should execute next and which should execute last this kind of priority you can set means order of execution you can control okay now we will see that one more uh, with priority okay now we will see with priority what is with priority and how it will be executed uh, in the previous we have written this is one and this is two right now what we will do i'll take one more and i'll give this as three okay this is three means it should execute first it should execute second and it should execute third in the previous example if it is this is zero as third test executed first but here we made this priority to three means it should execute last okay now we'll write uh, right click run as test ng set and we'll execute and we'll see what will happen sorry run as test ng test now if you observe this one second test has this high priority one so second test executed first you see second test executed first and 
start test priority is equal to 3 it should execute last you see it executed last and the fourth test is the priority 2 and it executed second this way you can control your execution flow using priority attribute of test annotation okay this is what priority and uh, if you have the say if you give the same priority to, to all the test cases means i have given 3 to first one 3 to second one and 3 to third one means all the test cases have the same priority now what will happen if you run as test in this test if you see the output you see fourth f s t f comes first second means it took the alphabetical order again the reason is if you set the priority to all the test cases equal then automatically it will take the alphabetical order this way you can control your execution flow and we have seen this without priority uh, partially used priority means for one test case we, have, we did not given any priority and remaining we have given priority and with priority means we have given priority to all the test cases and we tried to giving the same priority to all the test cases how it will execute this is what priority in testing g thank you for watching this video don't forget to subscribe to automation testing channel and please like us at our facebook page